how to connect Asana to Google Calendar. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and for today's video, I will show you a quick tutorial on how you can easily connect your Asana task or your Asana calendar to your Google Calendar. So without further ado, let's get started. So first thing first, you need to visit the website asana.com and just a quick overview, Asana is a project management tool that you can use to organize your project and to track your task and your project to make sure that everything is on time and you will not miss anything. So first thing first, you need to first create an account here and you can connect your Google account if you like to. So I already created my account here, so I will just log in. All right, so I just logged in here inside my Asana account, and this is the main home dashboard of the Asana. So here, as you can see, I can have my task assigned here for me. So these are the tasks that assigned to you, and you will also see here who assigned that one for you and also you will see here your priorities and these are the tasks that you need to focus on because these are the tasks that are near to do. So first thing first, you need to go ahead and create your project here. So I have different projects here, like we have the content, I have the cross-functional project. So here, as you can see, I already have different tasks added to this project and there are also other tasks that already completed, but I can just uncheck this one. So over here, you can see also the board view of the project, the timeline view, and the next one is the most popular, the calendar view. And here inside the calendar view, of course, you can also change the due date of the project here easily by dragging this one to different um, date. So for example, over here, or you can also expand this one if you like to. You can also expand the project by clicking the project. You will open the project information and over here you can also make some changes. So you can add some descriptions and also you can add some subtask over here. You can also ask some questions or post an update regarding with this uh, projects. And over here, of course, you can also change the project from planning to milestone if you want to make it more like a milestone. And you can add this project to different project that you have here, for example. So you can move this one to content if you like to or add it to the content as well. So this is the task look like inside the uh, Asana. So let me just go ahead and close this one. So here are the tasks that I have here. And over here, I can also easily mark the project done. If I'm done with this, I can just click this check button to done the project. And as you can see here, it will look like this once it's done. But you can also uncheck that one to mark that one as undone. So going forward, if you like to connect your Asana, a calendar to your Google Calendar so that you can easily get access to your Google Calendar. You just need to um, click over here and then we have this drop down arrow. Just click this project actions and over here you have this export. Just click on export, go to sync to calendar and you will have this link. You just need to copy the link and also you have the instruction here. So you can go to Google Calendar and in the bottom left, find other calendar, select from URL, and then from the menu, copy and paste the address provided above. So this is the address over here. So we already copied this one. And then includes only incomplete tasks with due dates. The initial sync to your calendar should be instant, but updates to due dates in a sign -up may take a while to reach your calendar sometimes up to a day. So it takes a little time for the Google Calendar to update whenever you do some update inside your Asana calendar. So which is kind of inconvenience for me, to be honest. And also we have note here, anyone with this link has access to your task. So be careful how you share it. Oh, okay. So you need to be careful. So for this one, let me just close this and let's go to our Google Calendar. So let me first type in Google and then over here, let's just click this six dots icon up here at the right top corner. 
And then let's just go to our Google Calendar. So we have it here, Calendar. All right, so here is my Google Calendar over here. So for us to add this Asana inside our Google Calendar, we just need to go here on the left hand side. You can see here, down here, we have our other calendar. So just click this plus icon, add another add other calendar and over here you have different option to add different calendars so here we just need to make use of from url since we have a url address that we just copy from asana so yeah we're just going to again uh, by clicking here go to the export and make sure that you copy this link because this is the url link that we will be using to paste it here and then over here, you also have option to check this box, make the calendar publicly accessible. So let me just go ahead and check that one and then just click add calendar. All right, and with that, we successfully added our calendar. So now, as you can see here, we have our setting for other calendar. We have our calendar sync here for Asana. So let me just go ahead and go back to our settings. And here, as you can see, I have now my other calendar is here showing up. And if I click on this, I, I don't have any task for this week. So let me just go ahead and click on the next week. And here, as you can see, I have my task over here. So these are the tasks that I added from the um, Asana. So get it, get it. If I uncheck this one, you will see that task will be removed from this one. But if I will check this one, you will see it here. So everything is here. Let me just go ahead and click on Wednesday. So by the way, we also have a start date here, but it's only available for premium account. So what can you do with the start date is that it will show up the the start date of this task until it finished for example the start date of this um for this project let's say it will start this sunday so it will be sunday until wednesday it will show like that one like this uh tab over here it's going to be very long and it will show up the uh, redesign landing page task. So something like this, as you can see here, I can name this one. So inside your Google Calendar, you cannot reschedule tasks over here inside your Google Calendar. You can only make changes inside your Asana calendar, which is for me not that helpful. Yeah, I guess that's all for today's video. And thank you so much for watching.